You say hi. Hi. Hi guys. So welcome to another FAQ Fridays. I apologize. I totally skipped last week's FAQ Friday. That was because we were packing for camping and then on our way to camping and we didn't have any Wi-Fi and we just, it just got super busy. So I was like, I can miss just one. Do you want to tell them where we're going tomorrow? We are going yard sailing tomorrow. <laughs> she loves going yard sailing. I do too. I love yard sailing. This FAQ Friday is a question that I get um, a lot actually. And this is about baby names. This is going to be about how we came up with the kids' names that they have now and what they would have been if they were the opposite gender. So I'm gonna start with Lilia. For Lilia, we had, I can't remember if we had a boy and a girl name picked out before we found out what it was or if we had to c come up with the girl name afterwards. But either way, first of all, how we came up with her name. I always loved the name Lily as a nickname or whatever. And so I usually, if you have someone with the nickname Lily, you name them like Lillian or Liliana. So we were talking about girls' names and I asked Gabe what he thought about that name and he's like, mm, I'm not too fond of that. Gabe actually suggested the name Lilia because he knew that I liked the name Lily and I don't know how he thought of it. It wasn't like in a baby name book or anything that we that I know of anyway. And I had a baby name book that and we sat there and like looked through the whole thing. But he just suggested Lilia and I was like, that is beautiful. I love that name. So that is how we came up with Lilia and her middle name is Jean. Jean is passed down from all the girls on my side. My middle name is Jean, my mom's middle name is Jean, my grandma's middle name was Jean also. That is how we came up with the name Lilia Jean. If Lilia was a boy, we did have a boy name picked out. We planned on naming her if she was a boy. It was gonna be Steven Gabriel. Um, we came up with Steven, it's my uncle's name, and it was just a name that we both liked. It was a, I don't know, just a name that we both liked. And Gabriel, of course, is Gabe's full name, so we were going to put his middle name as the middle name. So if we had a boy, it was gonna be Steven Gabriel. Then got pregnant with the twins. We had two girl names picked out and two boy names picked out. Of course, their names are now. Baby A was born Kyson, that's K-Y-S-O-N. And his middle name is James. And then Kaden is spelled K-A-D-E-N and his middle name is John. So for Kyson, we were looking through a baby book and we couldn't agree on like any names like at all. And we came across the name Kai. Drake really liked the name Kai, like K-A-I. Like a, it sounded more like a nickname to me than an actual like name itself. Since he liked it so much, I suggested, and I, I thought I had made it up at the time, but since then I've met a few Kaisens, so I guess I didn't make it up, but, and I didn't see it in any baby books, but I found myself liking names that ended in S-O-N. So just like, in general, there were a couple names that, that had that ending, and so I kind of just, had like an epiphany and I like put it together and I was like well how about like Kaisen because he wanted to have the nickname Kai even though we never call him Kai nobody ever calls him Kai now but that was like the initial reasoning behind why we chose that name so it was originally you like the name Kai and I like the ending S-O-N so we just like combined it it was like a compromise for Kaden's name my best friend Courtney actually suggested it to us and I fell in love with the name Kaden and I just mentioned it to Drake and he was like sure that's fine he didn't really care so that's how their first names happened and then Kyson James. James is Drake's dad's name, so we wanted to name it after him. And John is just a very, there's several people in my family with the name John, so it was just something that we passed down. And at that point, we already had Lilia was Jean, and we knew Kyson was gonna be James, so we were like, let's just keep like the J's going. So that's kind of like the story behind the J's. There's not any like really significant meaning behind the J's, but all of my kids do have J middle names, as well as me and my mom. So that's kind of like a little tradition. Um, and if they were girls, if you guys have followed me for that whole time, I did talk about what girl names we had picked out. Um, if Kyson, I can't remember who was who, I wanna say if Kyson was a girl, baby A, we were gonna name her McKenna. If Kaden was a girl, we were gonna name her Annabelle. So looking back now, I'm glad I had two boys because I, I just love like the matchy names and they're probably gonna hate me for it when they're older, but like Kyson and Kaden just goes. And like McKenna and Annabelle, I don't know. That's just like, it's not as matchy. So I, I think it was just meant to be with the twin boys. So then Landon came along. Figuring out a name for him was extremely hard because I, I don't know, there's just something about me and matchy stuff. I just weird like that. Lilia's obviously an L and the twins were both K's and I really wanted my fourth one to have an L too. So I had like two L's and two K's. 
So I was really set on having an L name. So I looked through like every baby name list on the internet and tried to find some, some kind of L name that I like. And I overlooked Landon so many times. And at one point, I think one of my friends mentioned it to me and they're like, what about Landon? And I was like, oh, I love that. I absolutely love it. So I don't know if I just didn't see it before, but like when I heard somebody actually say it, I fell in love with it. I was like the only name that Drake and I could even agree on, semi-agree on. And Joseph is my dad, my stepdad's um, real name. He goes by Glenn, but his real name is Joseph Glenn. So Glenn is technically his middle name, but Joseph is his real name. And I wanted to pass that down because he he's had a huge role in my life growing up. So I just like wanted to name I don't know, have some kind of name be after him. And if Landon was a girl, we had zero names picked out for girls. We had no idea. So it's probably a good thing that he didn't turn out to be a girl because she would have had no name. <laughs> because I was so set on like having an L name, he, Drake was like more crazy with the names. Like, he liked really, really unique and sometimes just straight up strange <laughs> names. And I was more, I was like leaning towards something that I've like heard before. I don't know, we just had very, very different tastes in everything in life actually, but names in particular. So we were leaning towards, um, at the time before finding out what we were having, we were leaning towards the name Layla. So that's probably what she would have ended up being named. That's as far as we got with that. So um, anyway, that is all. I hope that answers all your guys' questions about how I came up with the name and what they would have been if they were the opposite sex. So that is it for this week's FAQ Friday and I will talk to you guys for my next video. Bye. Everybody is always asking us when we are going to get our place together. So the answer to this question